Hey guys, so today I'm going to show you how to install IPA files on your directly on your iPad uh, using uh, with that using Installhouse. You know about Installhouse, right? So, but we're not going to use Installhouse, but you need Installhouse in this. So the first thing is you need Installhouse. So the second thing is you need Safari download enabler. The third thing is internet connection or Wi-Fi. That's uh, then the next thing is Cydia. Well, actually, Cydia is the most important thing you need. So you you can get install house from hackola.us then you can get safari download enabler which is available on Cydia for free well just go to search and type in safari download enabler uh, once you start typing safari you get this option over here safari download enabler just click on install and you have to respring your device then go to then once you do that, go to Safari. Um, then you go to. Oh uh, wait, do I have that page? No. So the thing is, I think it's called apptracker.com. Oh, there's one more iPhone apps.com. I think. Well, I think app tracker. And there's one more also. So I'll well, if App Tracker doesn't have the link, I'll use iPhone IPA. Just type in iPhone IPA, then this is the link iPhone Apps IPA.com. Okay, now so in this thing, just go and search for any download you want. So I'm gonna quickly download a game. Well, okay, I'll download in this one. So iPad games. App Tracker sucks. So um, <clears throat> somewhat, I need a smaller game, not a huge one. Oh no, these are all big ones. Man. So then I just type in Angry Birds Season Season. Okay now just go and I'm since I'm in a hurry I just download the iPhone version because it's a 25.3 MB file. Now you need to get is a Lime Links file. Because Lime Links file is the fastest download thingy. Because other links are horrible. I mean this link file is the worst. Then the next good link is Sense Space. If you don't have Lime Links, you can go for that. Well you can see over there it says app tracker. Some of the links are from X Tracker, I think. And it's gonna open up. I hope the file is available because sometimes the file is not available. Yep, it is available. You can download and over oh yeah, here, you see it's getting downloaded. And uh, it will take around a few minutes. Uh, well, I can't pass the video because I'm using, I'm recording using the display recorder. So please bear with me until. The download finishes. Well, you can record your display like how I'm doing using Display Recorder. The only problem with this Display Recorder is that sometimes it automatically resprings the device if it is an iPad 1 or iPad 2. Well, not that much in iPad 2. Okay, so download is over, so you click on Open in Finder. So, this is the place where you have to be careful. This is the place where you have to save it. So you go into documents, go to install out, go to downloads. I'll show you again. So this is the thing you will be in the beginning. Go to documents, install out, downloads. Just go click on save. That's done. Now head over to install out now don't do anything over here just go to downloads you will see that whatever you download what you download is an app will not have an image because you do not download the uh, the thing but it doesn't matter just click on it click on install and it's just going to install like a normal app well you can even do this using iFile but uh, since finder which is already baked into the iPad is working fine why use iFile? 
so it's, it's gonna finish in a few seconds you see it's installed now where is it so yeah right there so as you can see it's working so then thanks for watching please comment rate and subscribe thank you